Wedding season is approaching, so we want to make something which is non-fussy, but at the same time very refreshing and good to make. So you've told me we're going to make what? Cold spice. Cold it's spice. It's it's a sort of a mojito. It's a variation. Now mojito is one of those drinks which you can experiment with a lot. I mean, just throw in something and you get a new sort of mojito. You know, so we have had normal classic version mojitos, but apart from that, there's just so many things which you can make. Apart from the mint, if you throw in fruits, it's a different sort of a mojito. If you throw in spices, it becomes something else. So we are going to add some spice and make a cool. Cool spice. Cool spice. Let us. All right. I see a lot of nice things. Tell me. Basically, it's a vodka based cocktail with cucumber in it. Cucumber. Cucumber fresh here. Yeah. All right. So whenever you cut cucumber and you you keep it lying, just throw in some ice cubes. It keeps it cool. Okay. Then we have mint leaves in it. Mint leaves yeah. are here. Okay. Really nice and fresh. Lime mm -hmm. wedges. Lime wedges. How many go in? Two to three. Just two to three it and lime drop wedges. It. Yeah. All right. All right. Then we have the ginger syrup, the pink one. The this one. Yeah. That's a ginger syrup. Mm, that's ginger syrup. Then you have the mojito mint syrup. This is really, really strong smelling mojito mint syrup. It, it reminds me of toothpaste, so I don't like it much. If you want to just keep it aside, you can. But all right, let's yeah. follow your procedure. All right. Then and you have the 60 ml of vodka in it. 60 ml of vodka in it. Correct. Perfect. All right. Really, really simple. See, everything which I have put in here is available at home. If you worry where to get these syrups from, they're available by large at supermarkets these days. So not a problem. All right. You might want to arrange your stuff, and then we'll start making it. Yeah, sure. This is a shaken drink. It's a muddle and shaken drink. It's a muddle and shaken drink. So I need a Boston shaker. Correct. Super. All right. Now I also call a mojito a budget drink because uh, it can be made into large quantities, and I have done it a lot of times at home. So if you're throwing a party and if you worry what to do apart from the very basic normal cocktails, make a a pot of mojito, a pitcher of mojito. Just just too much of it. It's very simple to make, and guests can just can come. They can. Put the glass, dip the glass in that pitcher, and just get as much mojito as they want to. Okay, perfect. So uh, we'll start with mint leaves, the cucumber, and the mint. Cucumber. Leaves together. Okay. Four to five. Four to five pieces of cucumber. Mm -mm -mm. Also, eat some healthy. Sure. Okay. Then we'll add some four to five mint leaves in it. Four to five mint leaves. One. Just break it and drop it. Okay. Hmm. That's it. Okay. Squeeze some Squeeze lime. lime. In it. Yeah. Two lime wedges. Two to three is fine. Now. Okay. One. Okay, done. Just have to muddle it. A gentle muddle. Okay. So we have to get the the flavor of the cucumber. So just muddle it gently. So that you get all the flavors out. Superb. Don't turn it into a paste. Okay. We we'll pour some ice. Ah, nice. Pour ice now. Yeah. Okay, what about ice here? Fill this glass up with ice. All right. Perfect. Hmm. Now. Add the both the syrups, the ginger syrup. This is the ginger syrup. This yeah. is how much you said? Five to ten ml. All right. This goes in. Then the mojito mint syrup. And the toothpaste syrup, <laughs> just a little, because we already have mint leaves, so not a problem. And, and sixty ml of vodka. Sixty ml of vodka. Cheers. Cheers. Lovely. And now we give it a good shake with a Boston shaker. Yep. Okay. Let me learn a new sir. How do you do it? Yes, yes. Yeah. There are so many ways you can shake your drink. And always have that look on your face. Then Okay. Let's go. Done? Yeah. Superb. All right. Okay. Hmm. Now, then with the martini glass, you put the uh, the lime rim. This is a martini glass. We yeah. need to Rim it. Oh, we'll rim it with this. Now, like I said, this is cool spice, and it, this is a beautiful rim. Our friend here has made. This is this it's is a, what? It's a rim of uh, salt and chili powder. Yeah. This is a rim of powder. salt and chili powder. So you just mix both. Mix both. And that's how you have it here. Okay, not a problem. So this is here. Now, in order to rim it, like we do always, Correct. just run a lime wedge on the sides. Okay, superb. And then. We are done with the beautiful rimming. Okay. Nice. It's perfect. Okay, now we strain this. Yeah. This is double straining a drink. 
Now, generally, like I've always told you, this is a Hawthorne strainer. Get this one. But like I said, we did not turn it into a paste. The uh, the yeah. cucumber yeah. and uh, the other things which we put in. So we need to to avoid the pulp yeah. of any sort in the drink. So we'll double strain. So this is one. This is the second one. Perfect. Just pour it in. Very good. Hmm. Nice. It's time to garnish. It's time to garnish. Yeah. Okay, okay. What do we garnish it with? It's a cu cu cucumber stick with the cherry in it. A cucumber stick with cherry in it. Now, like I said, this uh, this episode of 69 cocktails is turning out to be an experiment. Uh, focused co uh, cocktail episode of sorts. Um, we have experimented with our cocktail. We have done it with the kind of things we are putting in in our cocktails. And now let's experiment with the the garnish because I see a beautiful garnish. Show, show that to me. Just the garnish. Yeah, this is what he already has prepared. This is the garnish for this drink. But I would like to make it so that it's just easier for you. So how do you make it? Just take it's a cucumber. Okay, so you it's it's very simple. This it's is a sticky. slice of cucumber. Yeah. Very simple. So you just put in like a small piece of a toothpick and then you take a cherry and then just poke the cherry with this. Perfect. And it is ready. Now drop it. Just drop it in. And this is a beautiful garnish to a beautiful cocktail. Let's keep it like this. So it looks like the cherry is happy. It looks like somebody's lying down. Oh, it is this Pinocchio. See, this is the head and this is the nose. Very nice. All right. And this is for you. Yeah. Made in the same way. This is Pinocchio chilling in our drink. Okay, perfect. Now is the time to taste this drink. So, here goes. This I know will be good, so. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, people. Hmm. How can you not like a mojito? A mojito is always awesome. This is really good as well. And since we spent so much of time making the garnish, make use of it. Cool spice ingredients: cucumber, four to five mint leaves, two to three lime wedges, ginger syrup, mojito mint syrup, 60 ml vodka. Take chunks of cucumber. Add mint leaves and squeeze lime wedges in it. Muddle it gently. Fill the glass up with ice. Add 5 to 10 ml of ginger syrup and mojito mint syrup. Now add 60 ml of vodka and shake it well. Rim your martini glass with lime and dip it in salt and chili powder mix. Double strain your drink into the glass. Garnish it with cucumber and cherry. Your cool spice is now ready.